Hey, good morning, folks. Zach Minmo from Minmo Creek Master. Just thought I'd give you guys a little show since I ain't been out finding anything. It's been so cold, and dry, and need to rain. So, figured I'd show you guys some of my dad's finds from his over the years. Look at that Snyder right there. He's got some nice ones. He's got boxes and boxes full of them, brokes and pieces and everything like that. I'll have to go through sometime. Killer dicks in there, drills. It's a nice little axe tomahawk there. Killer little ones, a little cokey there. That's nice or whatever they. He's found some nice ones. That was his killer the other day or a while back that he found with me. I think this black one here, this one, or one of the other ones my mom found. This one or this one. I think this one was my mom found. Nah, look at that, baby. Isn't that killer? He's got some nice stuff in here. Big game ball. Just a lot of cool stuff. Look at this old coin. My brother found this in a creek. Same creek I found the, my bullet in. My Civil War bullet. All these came from that creek. Pretty crazy. I just thought you guys would like that. Put a little something up on the channel. This we found in South Carolina. They're like turtle heads or something. Petrified turtle heads is what they said. Now, if that's true or not, who knows. <clears throat> Look at this big, giant thing. Goodness. Look at the polish on that. Isn't that killer? It's huge. That's just some of his better finds and all that. Just thought you guys would like to get a look at those. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. And then he's got some some of his other stuff. A bunch of his ads. Just some other broken pieces. Pretty sweet. Pretty dope. I won that at the artifact a, year, a couple years ago. Artifact show. It's one of my bow deers. Another one of my bow deers. And then that's a rifle kill. And I got two more mounted. And then all mine out in the shed. But just thought you guys would like that. So hopefully I'll get out soon and find some killers. But right now I'm not looking good. Maybe I can find a place to dig. So, but. Till I get out. Hope everybody's having a good good time and finding some killers out there. Like always, thanks for watching everybody. Later. Hey guys, Zach again, Mimo Creek Master. Uh show you one other thing. This little dude right here. This is what got started it all for me. I was six years old walking with my dad walking the creek. And he was down by the water and I was walking up underneath tree limbs and stuff like that. And I looked down and I said, Holy cow dad, is this one? And picked up, took it, ran down there, and he started freaking out. Couldn't believe it. I mean, it's about the size of my thumbnail. I mean, it's just perfect, too. Just laying there right on top. I'll never forget it. First one I ever found. And I was hooked ever since. Thanks to my old man. Got me into it. Thought you guys would enjoy that. Pretty cool. And then one other thing. Thought you guys would like, since I showed you some of my deer heads. This is my, uh little hunting room here all these sheds I found all the deer up here I've killed all those are rifle kills most of them in all my sheds <laughs> I got a bunch more to put up there too and then that was a bow deer that was a bow deer 2016 shot him off the ground Stocked him. It was awesome. 
That was a bow deer. That was my rifle deer from last year, 2020. That's this year's. And then that was my 2018. I don't know if I, if you guys seen all this or not, but that was my first deer I ever shot when I was 11 years old. Hickory County, Missouri. Yeah, boy. 11 years old. I freaked out. It was cool. Just some other gizmos. Thought you guys would like that. The trophy wall and the shed wall and trophy wall. And then Ruger wants to say hi. <laughs> Alright, everybody. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, have a great weekend. Till next time, everybody. Later.